In the past, we could only import QS CAD measurements into Master Bully once. But with the latest releases, we're now able to do that more than once and therefore update the quantities and override the quantities that we've previously imported. Now, there might be two reasons why that you might wish to do that. One is that your quantities have changed um, due to revision of the drawing or you've measured more. Or secondly, because you've reallocated your phasing and your filters and you wish to reallocate the calculations. In this drawing, I'm going to measure a few more areas that I haven't measured previously and I want to incorporate them now into the measurement that I'd already imported into MB Elite. So to do that, just normal measurement, don't have to do anything special. We'll tell it which phase it's going in. And in phase one. And measure as normal. The other reason you may wish to update the quantities that you've already imported into Masterful Elite might be because the phasing has changed. So in this project, houses 5 and 6 are going to move from phase 3 to phase 2. To do that, I'm going to make the most of the edit functions. These are multiple edit items in a region, crossing an area. So anything that comes somewhere in this area I'm going to draw can then be edited. As a result, it's picked up all of those measurements, so I'm going to make sure that they are all in phase 2. Once I've done that, I can generate a new summary and filter that summary by phase and generate a new main summary, which now gives me new quantities for all of the different phases that I'm now going to import into Master Bully. So no to a prefix and the export is complete. In Master Bully, all I need to do is re-import the CAD file. So I can say import kids CAD. I pick the file I just created and I can choose to import it. One big change here is that I'm going to say amend existing quantities. I'm once again going to use the allocate part using filter 1 and I'm going to make sure they all go into the external works element. I toggle all the items that I wish to import, don't have to do all of them but I'm going to in this case and say OK. What that will do now is that will update all the quantities in my master elite project to reflect those that have changed in QSCAD without any need to amend any DIMMs or anything like that and it's done it all automatically for me. In order to show you how that's impacted, it's hard to show you in here but it's easy so if we put this sort of slide together, so we've put a slide together to show you how.